There's a quiet in the cellar And if they find us It'll be all she will By the time the ground had thawed The summer she had barely spoke I feel so I feel so blind to what you're saying And if you don't And if you don't know the cost we're paying classic case of stable. It's the cold feeling of regret you get in the pit of your stomach when you've loved a pretty girl and you've let her get away. This is the sense that your young life is full of hope and longing, is disintegrated into little more than existence. That your dreams are over without having ever started. When you're little and everyone asks you what you want to be when you grow up, no one bothers asking you how you're going to be, or who. Greeks had so many sayings about strangers, treat them right, welcome them into your home. Being discourteous was considered a crime. I sometimes wonder how many times I've committed that same crime, sitting here, begging for the acceptance of a pretty girl. I know that for as long as I sit here, and we are perfect strangers, our relationship is ideal. It is non-existent, and therefore eternal. While I sit here, she and I have infinite potential. We could be anything. We could be happy. I'm scared that when she asks, can I borrow a cigarette? She'll find out I'm not who I say I am, not who I think I am, and not everything she wants me to be. It's happened to me before. It could happen again. It hurts to think that something is only perfect when it doesn't even exist. Sometimes I imagine us in bed together. The time is 1.37 a.m. The place is my bedroom. Or yours. The blinds are drawn. The window is cracked. A soft breeze plays over our sheets. As the dome of the night makes you a silhouette, you turn over. You look at me bleary eyed. Why can't you sleep? And as my hand passes over you, I pull a spare pillow into my arm. I whisper. It's not that I can't sleep, it's that I just don't want to. Sometimes silence can say more than words ever could. Sometimes a book can hold on for too long. This, this is a push, this is a pull. This is putting pen to paper and letting the scattered pages decide for themselves. I wish that you could feel the same hope at the end of a journey that you felt at the beginning, that you could have that eternal sense of going somewhere. But I guess if you did feel that, it wouldn't really be going anywhere at all. So, uh... 